Greenwalk Danny in Las Vegas here for Stevenson Valdez fight week. Just got done with the press conference. Shakur, um, last time you guys are really going to talk to each other. Tomorrow will be the final face off at the weigh in. Uh, what did you see when you guys faced off? Or do you even pay attention to, to that when you face off? I look focused. He looked ready. Um, I'm fighting the best Oscar Valdez that he can be. So um, he looked sharp, looked good. I don't got nothing bad to say. I'm ready to fight though. Spoke to your grandfather this morning. He says that this is the most focused he has ever seen you, the hardest he's ever seen you work. Um, what does that say about you? Because obviously you've already been considered a hard worker, a, a focused champion. But now for your grandfather who's seen you your whole life, to say this is the best Shakur he's ever seen, what does that say about about your I work think, ethic? I think he, he paid attention to what I've been doing in camp on. Um, I've been focused. Um, I turned it up a new new levels, and I feel like I'm in great shape. So um, I think he just paid attention to everything that's been going on in the camp, and I know he watched my focus. He watched me turn it up more and more each day. And uh, like I said, I'm locked in, and I'm glad that he, he see what's going on. Obviously, this is a fight that you have wanted since you were in the featherweight division, but now becoming the champion at 130 and now becoming a father, do you think that it's almost better to be able to become unified champion and dedicate the fight to your daughter? Uh, most definitely. Uh, I dedicated my last fight to my daughter before she was born. So at the end of the day, every fight from now on uh, for the rest of my life is dedicated to my daughter. I'm doing this for my daughter. Uh, I got to put food on the table for my daughter. So um, that's all I'm thinking about. I want to make sure my daughter have a life that I never had as a child. So uh, it means so much to me and I got to go in there and keep doing what I've been doing. We'll do one more and, and, and lastly, uh, what do you say to other people of Newark, New Jersey who are looking up to you, who saw you from the ground up and, you know, have seen you come this far in, in your life so young? What do you say to the people of Brick City? Nook, we on. Like, I feel like we on. Uh, for all the young kids, I feel like uh, I want to let them know that they can do what I'm doing. They can go do something. Uh, try to get into a sport or whatever school however just you know don't always turn to the streets um you can make money in in different ways and that's what i'm doing right now so uh everybody know i love y'all we're gonna turn up saturday for the video feel free to hit the like subscribe and share as always if you want to support us to the next level head over to the patreon.com backslash the boxing voice we have tons of exclusive from border wars and title betting shows the list goes on and on and on but in addition to that if you guys have questions for fighters trainers and promoters this is where you can submit them we will run out get these questions answered and put it back on the show just for you guys appreciate it peace